Leo, welcome. Thank you so very much for stopping by. Thank you for watching my channel, Ivana Tero. This is weekly love and career reading for your sign. 29th of October until November 4th, 2018. With seven tarot cards already waiting in front of my camera. So, let's get started. My dear Leos, let me start with this one. Major Arcana, the Empress. What a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful woman. If you are male Leo, also you are beautiful. If you are male Leo watching this video, then this tarot card will transform to Major Arcana, the Emperor. So this is basically person in charge. But this is not business. This is not this type of being in charge. Simply it means that you know exactly who you are, what you want, what you have to offer, and with whom basically you want to be in the relationship with. This is also a sign of a mother, pregnancy, important fem female person in your life. If you are male, Leo. If you are a woman, then this is how you are described, described in the next seven days. Basically, very peacefully, you are awaiting for other people to talk with you, to approach to you, and above all, to respect you. It seems to me that respect is extremely important for you, not only now, but in general. Harvest of some kind is to be seen on this tarot card, so also you can expect your love life to flourish, both if you're single or if you're attached as well. Now, Six of Cups, family life with your children. Be patient with your kids and enjoy whatever your kids do to you, whatever they ask you. Be patient and explain to your children what play is all about, what life is all about and your role. You are extremely proud on your kids, extremely proud. And of course, everybody knows that Leos, both female and male, you're one of the best parents in Zodiac Wheel, in Horoscope. Six of Cups, your children need you. But this is love terror reading and probably you want to be more concentrated about love partner. If you already coupled with Taurus, Libra, Scorpio, Pisces or Cancer, you don't need me to tell you that you are in one blessed, beautiful, long-term relationship. But some Leos, both female and male, because of this Nine of Swords, which is tarot card of anxiety, not knowing who you are, where you're heading. You don't have a contact with your partner, with your lover, and you are worrying so, so much that you ain't gonna see this person any more. But just remember, if this is a real life, love, this love will prevail. If this is your waiting, waiting and waiting and waiting for many, many weeks and months, then probably maybe for some of you this person is not what your Leo heart is basically expecting and needing. If you need to do 
for this person much more than this person is doing any service back to you then probably this is the sign that you are on a wrong track but I can see you do not want to give up so this is your fighting for this person but how long you are going to fight because nine of swords is difficult tarot card which talks about you being trapped in some circumstances or situation with someone who simply does not respect you enough I really do hope so that this is not the sign of a prison I I am really hoping that this is not you know someone who is you know in prison and this is you awaiting expecting a call hopefully it is not but also this could be you so unhappy because you know this is you expecting a return and also this could be the sign of a long distant type of relationship so basically you look like a princess in prison prisons princess but you are imprisoned not in the tower you are imprisoned in your mind this tarot card basically means something very similar like major of Canada hermit so you can see this white dove communication new message is coming but when finally this message comes your heart will be destroyed and probably then will be too late simply too late I can't say that this person is playing with you I do not see that but I can see you expecting too much from someone who is not at this particular time as mature as probably you are next tarot card six of months by the way this is leo tarot card so my dear leo friend you belong in here not in here so use your mind your heart and say to yourself say to yourself I am proud I have my self-esteem and nobody can play and not being punished because you know how this person is treating you also this tarot card talks about public recognition and maybe this is you meeting someone who is publicly already known being recognized this person probably is very powerful and I think easily this person could be Leo your fellow sign could be Aries could be Sag especially Libra Taurus okay okay or Scorpio so this is someone who cannot resist you you have the power so use the power not in some negative you know sense simply whatever you need you will get whatever this is you asking for it's going to be given to you so go out and ask major kind of the magician is saying that you can manifest whatever you want whatever you want from a distance call is coming from a distance message is coming you have two weeks to decide to decide are you going to stay or are you going to leave are you going to take this opportunity or maybe you will choose someone else but let me repeat once again everything depends only on you this Taurus could be your colleague 
or maybe Libra. Scorpio probably is your neck bird. Gemini or an Aquarian, which also I can see in your reading. This is a person with so many problems, unresolved problems. So why you should think that you need to resolve someone else's problem? No, you need to enjoy in the next seven days and you need to manifest whatever you want to manifest. I have a feeling for some of you, you can choose between two people. So be like a princess, be like a Leo and choose what suits you the best. You can hear me shuffling my deck. Let me put three tarot cards in front of you if you want to know a little something about your ex. Maybe you are still interested into this person. The very first tarot card is Five of Pentacles. Queen of Swords and Three of Wands. So, what this means all together? Five of Pentacles is someone who is completely lost without you. And probably you know that. You said your peace and probably you have peace inside of you but this is someone begging you baby please come back give me some time and I will show you that I am better person now than before but you look to me very resolute very decisive saying well honey don't beg me anymore because I told you I'm not happy with this type of person. You look so much more powerful than this person. So this person basically is lost without you. This person looks like a monk living in some very dark place obviously without you. So this could be Capricorn Virgo Taurus trying to get you back but I think that you already made up your mind because this is you looking on the horizon I do not see you coming back or at least not just yet so baby come back to me but I think that this baby is just already somewhere else. So just remember if this means anything to you. Your ex now is on a very, very dark place because of you. And you said that to them. This will happen you will cry over me but back then you know this person thought ah what she's talking about but now this person know exactly exactly what you tried to explain that to them now let's move to career department you can hear me shuffling my deck and this is what I have for the next seven days Page of Cups, altruism, well Leo's how typical for you, trying to help every single colleague of yours. You must be rewarded because the way how you talk with your clients and probably with your colleagues, you know, nobody is, you know, doing that like you. So you're very altruistic, very, you know, ready to help your colleagues. You are extremely creative in the next seven days. You are very intuitive and very loving, giving person. I only can expect that sooner or later, if not before month of December, you will get a beautiful perk or bonus, you know, on your, on your paycheck. So, 
you can change yourself in the next seven days in emotional sense because I have a feeling that maybe just recently whatever now is happened happening in your love life I can see will be reflected upon your business so now you are ready to forget about any kind of trouble and if you work with the children you will enjoy in this type of work if you work like an artist you will enjoy in that if you work like a bartender or maybe you work in a restaurant maybe owning a restaurant so many people will tr will ask you you know to come back into into basically into your working place as again i don't know if this last part have you know any sense so basically many clients i can see many returning clients uh into this you know space where now you are working this is what I wanted to say. So, this is your weekly love and career reading. General one. But still. If you want to hear your story, call me and book a private reading with me. Please make sure to subscribe on my channel, like and share this video with your friends. God bless you all.